Hello, hello, everybody. We are going to be continuing our Pokemon Platinum playthrough. Every single time I say Pokemon, I want to add on Mystery Dungeon to the end before I get to the actual title. I, I just have the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon brain rot. It is there to stay eternally. It is now a part of my soul. But yes, last time we did these things, even though it probably won't actually name all the things that we actually did. We beat the ghost lady, I think. Just did not bother with the contests, because we need to drug our Pokemon with Puffins first. And I'm trying to save all my Puffin making... Oh yeah, we also did the Puffin minigame. Uh, horror. <laughs> pain. But, yeah, we did things. I think we got the bike last time. My memory is terrible and everything's starting to blend together. But let's see. Started from heart home and used cut. <laughs> Found the fist plate, which was just out and about, if I remember correctly. Used a PC box, because that was the most important thing. Beat Nathaniel, caught a Meryl. <laughs> uh. Yeah, we saved out here in the rain last time. Let's see. I think we were just heading everywhere. Anywhere, everywhere. Everyone is basically the same level, and I just realized. <laughs> and also, you have the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon music to begin your stream. That's also true. A bit of subconscious planting there. My out-of-typing suggestions like to say Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Ain't that just how it be? Let's see. I... I don't know why my brain is just being terrible of memory right now, so I don't know who has what. I think you have. Yeah, the XP share. I just wanted to double check. You can have it back again. Yeah, we're just gonna wander on. Let me actually go to my bag and see where we're going, like, map-wise. Here, map. I don't know why town map just doesn't register in my brain. All right, we're going to Veilstone. I forget why we didn't want to go to Celestic. Oh, yeah, because Psyducks were blocking the way. Yeah. <laughs> well, and then we... <laughs> I wonder if anything will happen at Valor Lakefront. Lake Valor. And then there's... Presumably, we'll then head to Pastoria, unless the game wants to send me to Sunny Shore, but we'll see. From there. Damn it. Do I care to go back for cut? Or did I teach somebody cut? Let's see. Nope, I don't have anybody cut with me. I guess I can go back and heal up Amp. If only I went a little bit further. Let's see if there's anything here in the day. It'll probably just be a normal Pokemon. It's another Meryl. Too bad for you, I already have the blue Pikachu of water. Now die. Oh yeah, <laughs> rain effects. <laughs> Apparently that... Oh, I should have used the magic leaf, I forgot. <laughs> I grabbed my female Eevee, and my shiny look did hit it. You! I just... Um, you are the shiny charmer. You charm, you you you, sh you charm all the shinies. You monster! You steal them all from everyone with your mere existence. Zippity doo da. <laughs> so I predicted it, just like I did when. <laughs> I was like, oh, the enemy has one health. I'm going to crit now. And then I did. Yeah. <laughs> oh, when things happen, they happen, don't they? Do I even care about getting that Pokeball, though? I mean, I'm here. I mean, I'm here. Game, I just wanted to get down to the Eevee, you bastard. It's like, oh, but we do have the deep deep top. And then the game was executed. Off to the gulag for eternity. Come along, Scarlet. 
You're not gonna do anything. You're just here to cut down trees that miraculously respawn in this magical world of hell. <laughs> the shiny charm item is a fancy container holding a bit of my blood. Honestly, that might as well be the lore. Why can't I ever do that bicycle maneuver when I want to? It's like, quick flick to the side. I dodge things. I become Neo. But when I want to do it, game says no. Hello, Kadabra. I'm gonna zimzala all over your bim. Like, why are, you, why are you even out here? Die. Oh, hey, it's Kinesis, the special Kadabra move that, like, <laughs> only Kadabra can learn. As in, Abra, evolving into Kadabra, cannot learn it. Only Kadabra. Which is just the weirdest, like, choice. Okay, goodbye. Weirdo. Well, might as well collect these berries since I'm here. Oh, it's in bloom, so I guess I can't grab you. I can't take its flowers. I can't murder it for fun. <laughs> if you want crits that badly, play Pokemon Scarlet and pick the uh, Grass Starter. Signature move always crits. It's not the fact that I want crits. It's the fact that there's just a whole... It, it's a, It's just that it's a constant thing. It's a running gag of evil. Where they get a lot of it, I get none of it. And when I do get some of it, it's only when they're already dead. It's more about the imbalance and the fact that it always happens. I don't know why I tried to do that. My brain was just like, hey, save some power points on confusion. And so I did. I do not control my brain. It has thoughts and things go blue. And it was Shockwave. Man. I mean, maybe I could give it to Amp. Unless Gramp already has it. Be kind of a waste to give it to Amp then. It's like I'm gonna use this one time use thing on a Pokemon that like already knows this move. Again, you'd think that somebody in this universe would have learned how to like crack a TM by this point. Because they're there are machines, they're technical machines. Somebody cheat the system. Crack it on open so everybody can have some of the super moves. We'll tank the move economy. Oh, hey, a lick a tongue. Hello. If you survive a uh, confusion, I guess I'll catch you just cuz. Indigo looked at the Lickitung, became slightly dumber for it. Of course you are. All of my worst enemies use that move. Are you also gonna have some kind of hypnosis move? You can break through an Indigo. Shouldn't you be able to get through the confusion because you're oblivious? Like, I feel like the oblivious, like, nature, like, skill should make confusion worthless because it's like they're, they're, so, they're already so oblivious they can't be confused. And then I shall throw a big pokeball at you because I can. Don't know why I went the cursor around that way, but okay. Get balled, idiot. You fucker. Why do you care to do that? 
your mere existence. You are a like a... Oh, come on. Why can't I throw a Pokeball in between the wraps? <laughs> or maybe I can then. It was just the end of round things going through. Or maybe beginning of round things going through. Also, if I throw the Pokeball, it sucks the Pokemon into the ball. Shouldn't that end the wrap? Well, fine then. We'll kill you. Unless that kills. Now let's go for some fun. Kill him! For his insolence of wasting two of my Pokeballs. Ah, HP up. I'll have to decide who gets that. My random movements have done this to me. Hello, hello, Meryl. I don't even think you're worth killing right now. Would be hilarious if you somehow have a faster speed than than Indigo. Would be double hilarious because it's a apparently a fat Meryl. I'll throw you in because we can. I guess we can just move ahead. Why are none of the joggers fighting me? Jogging's good for you. What if I don't believe you? What if I think you are a liar out to kill me? And a full heal. One of those things they'll be like, this is too precious to use, and so I'll never use it. Well, I guess I'll fight you guys. Because we can. I'll take on anyone. It can only make me stronger. Not a bad methodology. I'm taking the Veilstone Gym Challenge, but first... I'll murder you in the woods. Well, that's not good. Gliger is ground type, I believe. Hmm. <laughs> the Gliger, he is unintimidated. All right, so Amp, we shall shift you to Lancelot because we can. And Nova, kill the plant. Speaking of Indigo, I recently finished the Indigo Disc DLC for Pokemon Scarlet, and let me tell you, it was well the price. That's always nice to hear. Always nice to hear good things. <laughs> I also tossed the female shiny Eevee into the daycare of a male Psyduck until I get eight Eevee eggs. That poor Eevee. The prodigal, like, super child relegated to doom. Bubble beam him just because we can. And then the wing attack him, I guess. Kill that Lickitung for the sins of its family. Get bubble beamed, you claw handed bitch. Well, at least that was a critical hit that at the was at full health and managed to get a kill from full health. So even if it would have died normally, I'll take that kind of critical hit. Ooh, double level up. It continues to rain. And then he throws out his Buzel. Hmm. Guess we'll just focus down the Lickitung so it doesn't get too tanky. How dare you walk with Jet, my Nova. If I remember correctly, I think I had a Buzel, or at least used a Buzel a lot when I played Platinum the first time. Why do you hit my bird? My bird did nothing to you except attempt your murder. But yeah, I guess just nuke him. We shall be a little bitch and super potion our bird. How dare you try to stomp my bird. My bird has done nothing to you except try to murder. And that's the name of the game. 
Goodbye, Lickitung. If he somehow survived, I would have been very mad. Oh, hey, a Ralph. How adorable. I forget, when did my Ralts evolve? By the way, I think you scare me more than the Buzel. So, die! <laughs> Murder time for the poor Ralts. Goodbye. Annihilated. And yeah, I guess that was all three of that other Ace Trainer's Pokemon. Yeah. But there was no target. But nobody came to die. It's that motherfucker who has, like, die moves. Well, I guess, uh, send out charm because I can. Why not? How dare you gust me. <laughs> not very effective. Cuts more than half of the Pokemon's HP. Ain't that the magic of it? More bubble beam. I guess I'll foresight because I can. Not ominous wind. That damn move that haunts me in Mystery Dungeon. Then again, or was it another? Was it Silver Wind? I think it was from a bug type. Oh yeah, I forgot that you have a healing thing. It's just that you never get hit. To kill in this. I guess we'll Metal Claw because we can. And Jump Kick because we can. Apparently that Drift Bloom just really hates you. It hates the Bi Icon. Ah, oh, dang it, I thought I would do more. It's hard to tell. Sometimes, the, oh, it's not very effective, it still tons, does tons of damage. And it barely didn't heal him at all because it had no health at all to take away. And I'll level up for charm. Baton pass. I don't think I care, but let's see. Uh, switches places with a party Pokemon in waiting, passing along any stat changes. If I use strategy, that would be good. But I don't use strategy. You won and I lost, but the both of us gained something from this. That's a good methodology. My confidence is crushed. It's what you deserve. You thought you were a big, big bunion of the world, and then you just got smacked upside the head? You loser. Pick up all the berries, but never plant them. I don't even think we have a, a watering can. Movement is terrible. <laughs> Good evening, gentlemen and ladies. Yes, and everyone in between, too. I wanted to go to Celestic Town, but there were some Pokemon in the way. Who knows why they're there, but they're not budging. If they're Pokemon in the way, why don't you just fight them with your fists? I also managed to get all, un uh, all unknown other than P. Interesting. Oh, is this where we're going to get Rock Climb? Salute trainer! Uh, Tam le Pokemon? I have no idea what he said. The game corner is dangerous. Why is it dangerous? It's so fun, I lose track of time. That's all. <laughs> That's what gambling does to you. I got a TM as a prize from the game corner. I used to have my own Pokemon right away. 
Maylene is Veilstone's gym leader then. There, <laughs> then there's Wake and Pastoria. They're way too tough for me. I can't even come close to them. I wonder if this will be one of those gems that I have to pass on and come back for later. Heal my dumbass Pokemon. They fought too hard, and the law won. Also, remember to uh, stay hydrated. Drink your tea, everybody, and kill God. <laughs> Hello, trainer. You love your Pokemon? Ah, that's what the Frenchman said. How dare the French invade my game. Why don't... Why don't is, it, is it Kalos that is the French region? Or does this place even not have a French region? This place, I say, like the Pokemon world is a cafe. This singular place. Maylene, the gym leader, is a cute girl, but don't let her looks fool you. Even grown-ups have trouble with her. Phrasing. If you use the hidden move fly, you'll be instantly whisked to any town you've visited before. Give, give, give now. No, you can do this one wherever you want. <laughs> it's just the way this guy mentioned two made me think, ooh, do I have a choice? I bought a new parasail, but I don't want it to get rained on, so I watched the TV weather reports. Someone bombed this lady's house. If there are people who desire to see them, Pokemon will appear in many different guises. A myth says that Mount Coronet parted Sinnoh into halves. Seeing the Pokemon Shellus makes me think the myth is real. Hello, Bonary. Let me guess, just books chuck full of Pokemon books. <laughs> to be fair, the last gym leader we killed was French. I somehow forgot that. Then again, she didn't. She only spoke with an accent. Ah, uh, Porygon is near. The banned Pokemon. I came to the city just so I could go shopping at the department store. But with all these rock walls around, this place feels kind of cold. But can I buy dreams here? I made an accessory modeled after the Pokemon of a trainer I met. Would you like one? Neat. I like the formal air of a luxury department store. What do you sell? What are you buying? What are you selling? Who are you killing? God. I pre ah, good, I have nine. I can buy max potions here? What? I think I'll just stick to hyper potions. I don't think I need, like, max potions just yet. What do you sell? I'll take some Ultra Balls. I'll take 15. I'll take your whole stock! And like, I guess... Hmm. I think I'll just take some Super Repels. Just in case. I typically fight while Pokemon are run from them. But you never know. This department store knows how to ensure customer satisfaction. They really look after you once you become a regular customer. Your first time here, they slap you in the face. Why does the greeter have a bigger de desk than the actual sellers? This feels dystopian. I'm hopeless at cooking puffins, so I buy them. You can buy fucking puffins! You can buy puffins! And they sell berries! Baggy berries that I've, I've never heard of before. They're just berries. Huh. <laughs> and they're cheap as fuck. you sell if I say yes are you just going to give me a random one? Oh, dang it I didn't mean to oh well <laughs> that's what I get I deserve it rage candies 
<laughs> no thanks. Interesting, they're selling a bunch of things here. I'm all sold out. Is it because they're all the rage? <coughs> there is a limit to puffins a Pokemon can eat. Interesting. <coughs> Excuse me. That screech killed my throat. I'm getting the carbo, so I should get protein instead, maybe, but iron's not bad either. Drugs. I'm gonna give an HP to my Cricketot. It's gonna raise its HP, huh? You can't find matching dresses. They don't exist. Hello, small child, are you dead? I would love to buy up all the merchandise here, even once would do. Why, to leave nobody with anything else? You desire to hold everything and nobody else anything else? I wrote some secrets in my mail as a reminder. If someone reads it, I'm in deep trouble. Ah, natural gift. Ooh, false swipe for, like, uh, gathering. The problem is that then means actually <laughs> having a move slot for it. Very interesting. The permanent drugs. You ever get a Pokemon addicted to protein? Who dolls? <laughs> now my brain went like Chucky from the Child's Play franchise, <laughs> but <laughs> as a Pokey doll. That boy doesn't have any Pokemon, but he says he's training his image. Took a quick ball right off the bat. If it's taking a long time to catch the situation, calls for a timer ball. I thought he would sell things. I've had enough of shopping for a while. I'll grab a drink and unwind a bit. Two buff guys staying side by side. That's all. What? What's the problem? <laughs> ah, young Pokemon trainer. As your senior in life, let me make you a gift of this sticky barb. Okay. That sticky barb is a hold item. If the Pokemon holding it is hit, the sticky barb sticks to the foe and inflicts damage. I've shopped here loyally for years. Now they consider me a regular. Ha! Ah! Well, if you shop a place for years, yeah. <laughs> the murder doll in the shop, basically. Only two days until Pokemon Day. I need to make a, a picture for the day just before Pokemon Day of my Pokemon Mystery Dungeon fanfic team. Like, just looking at a monitor going like, please, please have a Mystery Dungeon announcement, please. <laughs> yeah, Team Galactic is hiding all sorts of good stuff in their warehouse. I heard they even have a hidden machine in there. A hidden machine? It's a mysterious meteorite that fell from the stars. <laughs> Instead of taking it, they just built... <laughs> built staircase to it. We have the hidden machine that teaches fly stored in the warehouse. They say that I can use it if I show them that I deserve it. They're never gonna give it to you, bro. It's like a tier... It's like being a tier 3 sub to a Twitch streamer. They're never gonna give it to you. You know where one might find a coin case? I heard that's there. that there's a clown giving them away. <laughs> one quick ball, 100 Pokeballs, then timer balls. That seems to be it. Oh, this is just the... Yeah, place to turn in your stuff. A man spoke to me in a foreign language. He really surprised me. I think he was asking if I liked Pokemon or something. Why does this exist? <laughs> if you don't mind me asking, what software did you use to make your PNG tuber? Uh, for the actual art, I just used Clip Studio Paint, but for the actual movement, I'm using the uh, program. It, it has a weird name. V-E-A-D-O Tube Mini. Viado Tube Mini. And it basically allows you to input individual pictures uh, that then swap between, like, different ones or GIFs to... Uh, to the sound of noise mic input and then you can 
make a little, like, uh, shortcuts to swap your expressions around. It's lightweight, but simple. I like it. <laughs> the evil stare. <laughs> you know, for the longest time, it, it like, even, even now, it, it takes a lot of brain power for me to play games and then, like, swap to the proper expression. <laughs> Say no to the massage girl. Well, now I'm interested. <laughs> Veilstone is the city of stone. We even have meteorites. There's nothing to do with anything but take this technical machine. Okay, generous man. If someone uses embargo on your Pokemon, it becomes impossible to use any items on it. Anyway, enjoy your visit to Veilstone, the city of... Well, stone. Well, stone. Oh, looking a little tired. Oh, not you. I met your Pokemon. If you'd like, I can give them a massage for you. Would you like that? Well, I was just told no. <laughs> I'm not doing anything shady. Well, now I'm definitely thinking you're shady. My sister's boyfriend is the scarf guy in Pistoria City. They send mail to each other by letting Pokemon deliver it. Like, what is she, a vampire? Yes, <laughs> You there! Watch this coin! Spin, spin, spin! Now which hand is the coin in? My left or my right? You're right. Bravo! A winner is you! For our winner I have here, a coin case! This clown is trying to get me to gamble. Why is your, why is your boyfriend a clown? There are many magicians in this world, you know. The performance artists. Don't you think that may be, say, 5% are actually psychics? It does raise your friendship with the Pokemon. Interesting. Oh, hey, Lucas. Hey, Neon, are you going to take on the gym leader? Well, you just keep getting tougher and tougher. Me? Well, I took a look at the game corner and... I mean, yeah, of course, I've been working on my Pokedex, but... Uh, anyway, keep it up! The ring is my rolling sea. The tower waves shaped me. Crush, 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 awake. Crush, 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 awake. I'm the tidal wave of power to wash you away. Put out the fire, crush, awake. Run from electricity, crush, awake. Ah, 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 the ring is my sea. Hello, dude and young lady. You're challenging the gym leader, are you? Let me tell you now, she's a young, but she's a born genius. I tried training with her, and I was stunned by how tough she was. Whoops, I'd better tell you who I am. I'm the triple threat gym leader in Pokemon wrestling and song. I'm Grudger Wake of Pastoria Gym. We'll meet again. Oh. Ah, you can raise your friendship with a Pokemon, but only once a day. She probably sucks the soul out of him. Out of anything. Either that or... Evil things could happen there, and by evil I mean, you know. What they say happens doesn't happen in the daycare, but does. Lucas is confused too. So, uh, yeah, Neon. Good luck with the Pokemon, Jim. I think they gave him a gambling addiction. <laughs> Your voice okay? <laughs> Actually, not that bad. The screech I did earlier in the basement was, or like, in the, the shopping center. That was worse. That was actually pretty easy. Because I just pushed my voice back rather than, like, <laughs> try to do something crazy with it. <laughs> it's actually one of the easier voices to do. Oh, hey. Indigo, you're gonna fuck this place up. And Charm is gonna fucking die. Hey there, how's it going, champ to be? The gym leader is a user of fighting type Pokemon. She'd be a terror against normal type Pokemon, but, and it's a big butt, a big ass, if you will. Just between you and me, Maylene, the gym leader, has said flying and psychic type Pokemon could be real trouble for her. If you want to battle her, smack the punching bags along the rails. You have to hit those bags hard. Time to punch some dick. Just be careful of fighting and steel types. Uh, 
Interesting. We must destroy tires. I thought I had to send it flying at that guy. Murder him while he stands there. I woke up with an idea as I looked for an ultra rank explore team pins for my Chimtar and Rialu plushes. Oh, that'd be sweet. That's a cool idea. Welcome to Puzzle Hell. I'm here to fight you in the ring. I'm here to make you die. We're the Karate Quads. I will strike a blow for love with my fist. Here, love! Oh, no luck on the pins. Sadness. Well, I hope you find at least some kind of alternative, because that does sound like a cool idea. Brings it all together. Get confused, idiot. And a critical hit. Yay! The critical hits are being kind to me today. Send another Machoke at me. Send another Machoke at me. Look at those pecs. We're gonna kill them. Only Guildmaster ones are first rank you get. Huh. Interesting. Why are you foreshiding? I'm not a ghost. Why do you think I'm a ghost? Die. Psychic attack! Fuck you! Well, if worse comes to worse, you could just, like, make it be like a, a super post game. Your team went on to make their own guild. And they're the guild masters. So I have to get team the fun gang to guild master rank for it to work. Oh, another critical hit! The game's being kind to me! I have earned the respect of the game! Oh! Get crunched, idiot. Hmm. Or do I go... Hmm. Well, let's talk to him. Your Pokemon sure are tough, but our gym leader, Mei Ling, will break you like a stack of bricks. Oh, there's an extra ring, diggity. Extra kickity 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 kickity. Hmm. I think I'll fire go. Hmm. Get smacked. No idea why, but get smacked. Oh, because this blocks off the area. I'm a fool. We're the Karate Quads. I will strike a blow for courage with my fist. Courage! I was also looking for an Explorer Team bag, but I wanted to make a small one for my Chimchar. That sounds adorable. to draw my mystery dungeon teams more. I did make a sketch for Team Lost Light from my Explorers playthrough, so I need to get back to it at some point. We'll send a Nova because... Well, actually, we'll send an Amp. We'll give Amp a shot. Basically, I just need to do more art in general. I just got distracted by a lot of things and brain. Look at the scary face of your doom, Metadite. Get charred. Wait. Shouldn't this do something? No, it shouldn't do it. Something sadness. Not the master hand backhand. How dare you? Now I'm going to paralyze your muscles so you can't move. Get sparked, idiot. Now we're going to have to leave this place to reset the movement of everybody anyway, so... At least I think so. Get sparked. I was going to do my team, but my perfectionist brain's like wondering how to draw the flame cap. I would say look at a ton... Like, look at a... Google search. D 
different kinds of caps or hats and then just study the various different type of caps there are. Make your own type of cap, the Chimchar cap. Become famous and then sell it. Why'd that do so much damage, you bastarding bitch man? With your fanciful pecs. Meanwhile, I was very simple and... Also, it doesn't help that I just never got anything from my team, really. I couldn't force myself my way to my victory blank. But yeah, it's just like, for me, the special items for my team, I just didn't really get that many, so I just... Yeah. Don't really include them all that much. Bite does neutral damage to Metatite. A fighting and psychic is Metatite's type. Then I guess fighting is strong. Oh yeah, fighting is strong against Dark. I forgot about that. My brain leapt to, aha, psychic is weak to Dark types. Completely forgetting that fighting interacts with Dark type too. I'm but a fool. But not a fool. But I also feel you on the perfectionism. Where your brain is just like, no, it has to be this way. And then you kind of just put it off and then you never do it because you want to get good at it at, by a certain point. But then you, because your perfectionism is evil, you're never actually going to get good at that thing to the level your perfectionism wants. So once again, I say, don't be me. Go forth and uh, do it anyway. Even if brain says perfectionism, trade perfect for done. And get her done! And do magical things, rule the world, become a god. And by becoming a god, kill god. Because now that we beat you, we can run along and not get blocked, I don't think. Hello there. We're the Karate Quads! I will strike a blow for hope with my fist! Yeah! Hop! Raphael. I haven't been paying attention to these guys' names. Are they all... Wait, no, I don't think the other one was... I don't think they are the... <laughs> the Fighting Quads... Ninja Turtles. Hello, hello. We are beating up gym people with our mind. As my brain is just going weird places. I accidentally bought a poffin. I don't even know which poffin. You know what? We're gonna send Nova out. We're gonna go supernova. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm drawing the hat like old Mario Kart 7 cap. You go, boy. I got one from a fair when I was young. Oh, that's super cool. See, that's how you need to do it. Take it from your real-world life thing and be like, this is now the canonical way of the thing. Make the world your world. And anything that doesn't belong in your world doesn't belong in your world. And hey, 69 HP. I just realized. <laughs> just got both heart gold and soul silver at a flea market today for a pretty low price compared to what prices are online. Huzzah! Good for you! Hell yeah. That's always fun. We came up short, but... Not by much. I defeated all your Pokemon and didn't even lose one. Not by much. You fool. You want a meringue? Ah, I think I understand this puzzle a little bit. Maybe. Even if it is, it isn't a puzzle. It is now a puzzle to me. <laughs> it's a puzzle to me! Also, this is a very poor, like, uh, laid out gym. Like, as an actual <laughs> gym. Just horrendous layout. I guess, like, setting up the, the tires would be good exercise, but why are all the lockers everywhere? And I still need to make the Cresselia meme. Brain goes, oh, it should be so simple. Hmm, I 
can I go this way? Because it did knock. Aha, I can go this way. This really is a puzzle. I don't think I have to worry about you. So fight me. Fight me, quad man. We're the Karate Quads. I'll strike a blow for the tears of my fist. Yeah, tears! That's me when I play Mystery Dungeon games. Like <laughs> Jeffrey. You're a mean little man, aren't you? <laughs> a bug fighting type, I guess? You're like, haha, you're gonna use a psychic, I'm gonna use one. <laughs> gonna play Soul Silver first. Hope it's a nice fun time for you. <laughs> Excuse me. Bleh. We'll see how much damage this does and then see if I need to worry about things. Okay, crit. Is, was that even a crit? That was just super effective. Jesus. Oh, because it's fighting bug. Super dead. Thank you. <laughs> Chat said bless you. I'm so hungry, kid. I don't have any strength left. I can't believe you just murdered this guy. I really need to, like, figure out my, like, Pokemon playthrough playlist of, like, games. Because I do want to play, like, Pokemon Ranger at some point. Then there's, like, other things. So many Pokemon games I want to get to eventually. Ooh. Alright, before I actually fight you, I want to see where, where this goes. Four times damage a flying type move. Yeah. <laughs> For some reason, I wasn't expecting it. Like, I got hooked on the... Like, uh... On one part of it. Oh, it's because then we can, uh... Yeah, fight her and go around. Let's see. I'll give a heals to my... My poor little darling, Nova. Nova deserves to be at tip-top shape so we can murder this bitch. I like when the outlaw teams like taunting you. The fl uh, like... Then three flamethrowers later, it's just out cold. <laughs> hmm. Let me see. <clears throat> like, maybe I should give HP to Amp, because Amp is seeming to become quite tanky. I really waited to buy a copy of Ruby and uh, Fire Gold, uh, Fire Red, Leaf Green. They had, but I don't have the GBA to play them. Ah, uh, the pain of like, do I get it when I can't even <laughs> when I can't even play it? And we'll go ahead and save just because we can, because it's saving a lot of data. Allows me opportunity to drink some tea. Stay hydrated, everybody. Saving a lot of data. All right, then. Fight me! Hello, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Maylene, and I'm the gym leader. I don't really know what it means to be strong or how I got to be the gym leader, but I will do my best I can as the gym leader. I take battling very seriously. Whenever you're ready. <laughs> I'm a dead person again. My heartbeat is gone. That's basically just every day. She has a cool design. Simple, but nice. And I only have the DSi, the only original DS system that isn't backwards compatible. That is that is kind of hilarious. Mm -hmm. 
Now that just makes me think, I really, really hope that, like, the next, like, uh, console from Nintendo is backwards compatible. Because having a console that is backwards compatible with, uh, Switch games would be amazing. You bastard, that's gonna kill, isn't it? Oh, it didn't. Ha ha, you fool! Now die! Sh why do you go first, you bastard? I should have healed. You fucker. You bitch. Of course, you have one move that's like, Oh, surprise! I can kill flying types! Woo! I forget. Does Rock do good? My brain always mixes it up with, like, ground. It's like, <laughs> always goes like, Does Rock affect electric good or bad? I want to have a retro shop in the Switch eShop. That would be nice. But sadly, they have the ba ba ba. The Nintendo Online, so they're not really incentivized to do it. Which is disappointing. I'll find it. Swapping back and forth. You'll drain punch again. Luckily, intimidate is nice. Random confusion. Works for me. Get wing attacked, idiot. And you don't even give much experience. Like in the overall, overall. I know it's because it was split against a lot of Pokemon, but still! I'm saying we have games lost to time, man. That's also true. There's lots and lots and lots of games out there. I wonder how many of them are, like, actually lost at this point. How many, like, minor games there were. Why was that a one-hit kill? Fuck you. Genuinely, die. <laughs> How the heck is a Meditite faster than Staravia or, or uh, Luxio? I don't know. It is an utter bitch. And of course you also know Rock Tomb. Why do you all have Rock Tomb? And, of course, you get a critical hit, you bitch. Fine, I'm gonna send out Lancelot, and I'm gonna heal up my team, because you a ho! Luckily, I'm rich, and I can buy all the things. Haha, <laughs> you stupid motherfucker, you missed. You missed, and you're always gonna miss. You're gonna go to your family's funeral, and you're gonna miss it. Then again, speed could have, like, the speed falling from the rock tomb could have maybe done a thing about it. Alright, we probably need to kill you. Sorry, mate. Die. Peck. Of course you get to go first, because you're a bastard. And after that focus energy, you... Oh, didn't do much. Why? <laughs> Why did one hit my poor darling Curlia? I guess, like, they just didn't have a good defense stat, but still. Oh, you have a Lucario, do you? It's part steel type, is it not? I want a Lucario. How come you have a Lucario? Oh, but this isn't the end, my friend. This is the end, friend. Throws you into a fire. I'm gonna heal because I'm going to um, I'm going to blast you with water. 
Also, why are you level 32? Was I supposed to do the... <laughs> Was I supposed to do the galactic uh, warehouse before this? And that basically did very bad for me. How dare you. Wah bubble beam! And of course you go first. How dare you have good stats. You belong in hell. That's probably... Hmm. Double team! That's probably gonna one-hit kill. Alright, Charm, you gotta have to be a sacrificial lamb here. Because this guy's a bastard. Fun fact, in Black 2, a level 99 Lucario can beat the entire Elite Foreign Champion alone. Interesting. It's kind of a glass cannon. Then you should also be as slow as a glass cannon. Do you ever see a glass cannon move? No, then you shouldn't be able to move at all. Let me guess, you're gonna go first. Of course you are, and you're gonna do a lot of damage, because you're a bastard. How dare you paralyze me? If not, then I'm gonna have to focus on Nova. Sorry, Shine, you're gonna have to be sacrificed. Because we need to make sure that we're in a good position. By bringing back the Bicon. Ah, you managed to survive that. Good job, Shine. Maybe, because this guy's a jerk who shouldn't even exist. If maybe I can get a few bubble beams off. That might slow him enough to get some double teams out. Come on, lower your speed. Lower your speed. Your dual typing of steel and fighting is annoying. Oh, hey, a crit when I needed it. <laughs> Get crit, idiot. God is on my side today. I'm in a bit of a bind, aren't I? And now you're going to heal, aren't you? This is going to be the double heal round, isn't it? I might be able to beat you just Lancelot now. Oh yeah, fighting fighting is super effective against him. Eh. Granted, the only one with fighting types on my team is Charm. The normal type. <laughs> Get bubble beamed. Bye-bye. Through the fire and the flames, I carried on, as well as through capitalism. Let's be honest, capitalism is the only reason we won. Do I care about Fury Attack? What's Fury Attack? 15 power, 85 accuracy is jabbed repeatedly for horn or beak two to five times in a row. I do not care. I already know my luck. I shall admit, de defeat, you are too much too strong. That I am.
Okay, you win. That was a tough loss. I learned a lot from it. Uh, that capitalism is the the the, the uh, terror against uh, fair fair combat. Please accept this gym badge. Huzzah! Um, I should explain about the official Pokemon League gym badge. With it, you can use the hidden move Fly at side of battle. Oh, and since you now have four gym badges, Pokemon obtained in trades will obey you up to level 50. Oh, and please take this as well. <laughs> Laughs in 99 full restores, basically. The TM60 contains the move Drain Punch. Um, that move inflicts damage and it robs the target's HP. A good deed for every day. One day at a time. Treasure every encounter, for it is unique. But I'm antisocial, and I don't want to do that. We just killed Michelin and his family. Mwahaha. Oh, Neon, you've beaten the gym leader! Of course I thought you'd win. I feel like he's lying to me. If you come to fight me now, I will stab you. Hey, Neon, listen, I need your help. Some Team Galactic goons grabbed my Pokedex and won't give it back. I sure could use your help. I'll be waiting in front of the warehouses. Please come. Well, at least that means that I was <laughs> in the right order of things. But where do I get Rock Climb? Climb, Klim, Climb, Klim. <laughs> so where's the training session gonna begin, considering you barely won? I do not know. <laughs> Cue the montage. Maybe. Should probably do that. Maybe up ahead there'll be a good, like, wild Pokemon area. What's this? Galactic Veilstone Building, we dream of the universe. What if I... Why do you have spikes on your building? <laughs> We're holding out for a hero playing. Or just the, uh... We're gonna need a montage song from, uh... What was it called? I forget what it was called. I think it was a puppet movie made by the same people that do South Park, I wanna say. Hey, Neon, listen, I need your help. Remember those Team Galactic goons? The guys who tried to take Professor Rowan's research results in Jubilee? I ran into them and they ripped off my Pokedex. Will you team up with me to take them on? You and your Pokemon together with me and my Pokemon. Our dream team's not gonna lose, not with the way we work together. I'm not letting these criminals get away with this. I'm here to kick your ass. And we have a team of cuties. Kill. Let's see how good it is. Hmm. Understandable, I guess. Why do you get a critical hit, you whore? <laughs> Isn't... Gravity intensified. Oh, that's interesting. Basically useless for us, because I'm not... I, it's not like I'm going to throw out... A, a, an earthquake. Like, maybe it affects their speed or something, but I don't know. Interesting, but I don't see the point, Lucas. Are they gonna double confuse Reyes? Zubat is a flying type. Yeah, I just figured I'd give it a shot. Because you'd think it would be more dark type now, but I guess they didn't want to change it after the first game. Quit teaming up on my charm. Guess he do that, do that more. I'm here to kick ass and catch Pokemon, and I'm all out of Pokeballs. 
Yeah, that's what I just said. It makes it so you can hit him with ground-type moves, and I said I don't have an Earthquake. I just said that, like, uh, in terms of its typing, I thought, by now, since they've introduced the Dark-type more, they would have, like, changed Zubat into a Dark-type, because it feels more Dark-type than Flying-type at this point. Oh, hey, good job, Clefairy. You murdered. Good. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, that's actually very interesting. <laughs> Can't high jump kick because of gravity. I kind of like that little detail. It seems pretty niche, but kind of cool. You're gonna metronome one of these days and murder me, aren't you? Clefairy, why do you get two critical hits in a row? Well, you're not going to be doing much of anything now that you're dead. <laughs> and gravity returned to normal now that he's dead. That crow gunk right there, officer. Good job. That should kill him. Murder time has been murdered. Done in by two kids? This isn't right! I should have kept my head down and just watched our warehouse. Isn't that what you were you kind of doing? Ah, <laughs> yes, Clefairy calling down Zeus. Ah, that stinks! Our Pokemon are chumps! But you get new ones from headquarters. Who cares about some Pokedex anyway? Team Galactus gonna own all the Pokemon in the world. No, in the universe! There, take it. Take your Pokedex. Those two things we had in the warehouse have already been moved to Pastoria City anyway, so we'll say you'll get yours and run away like the grunts we are! What's going on here? Why is Team Galactic out in the streets like they own the place? Neon, thanks, honestly. I'm useless about my Pokedex. I have to have it for a pr helping Professor Rowan with his studies. So, Neon, what are your plans now? I think I'm off to the Poke Mansion on Route 212. They say they show off rare Pokemon to visitors. Hey, looker. Have no fear, I have come running. I heard of children feuding with Team Galactic. It turns out, of course, to be you. Hey, it's that weirdo from Jubilee. You insult me to my face, how very uncouth of you. Oh, sorry, honestly. Oh, sorry, honestly. I was upset from having my Pokedex ripped off by Team Galactic. I didn't even think when I, when I spoke up. I'll be going now. Uh, watch out for Team Galactic. It is of no matter. Of more interest is the criminal behavior of Team Galactic. They attempt to steal the belongings of a child. The scale of their criminality, it seems, rather minuscule. The triviality of their actions make them more sinister, perhaps. Their warehouse needs investigation. Come with me and we'll take a look. I want to heal my Pokemon! I have been kidnapped by Looker. Hmm, a key is necessary for us to go on. For the time being, we cannot give chase to those who run away. Ah, this hidden machine, it is the hidden move fly. Neon, this you should be keeping. It will not do to leave this item here to be used by the Team Galactic. So, we did not learn very much from this exercise, no matter. What concerns me is what I have overheard in the game corner. The Team Galactic has transported something to Pastoria City. What they are up to, I do not know, but I have bad feelings about it. I can fly now! I can murder God! Well, this means that we can go pretty much anywhere that we've already been. And only that. Which means we can't really go all that much. Alright. Fly for the boy. For, <laughs> for the girl, Nova. One of these days, Gyarados will be able to learn fly. <coughs> Honestly, I'm never gonna use Endeavor. Like, I'm just, I'm never gonna. 
I probably should have against... What's his name? I found a star piece! I can probably sell that for lots of money. And now I can fly to all the places I've already been to. But first, we gotta heal Charm, because I want Charm to become a sexy bunny. Through the power of thick thighs, we will kill Team Galactic. One day, Groudon will be able to use Fly. Maybe. He's a legendary. Give him some wings. Some earthy wings. Huh. The Team Galactic Credo. Everything belongs to Team Galactic. Look beyond the world. Space will become Team Galactic's. Well, you can't have my space. It's personal. Welcome, this is Team Galactic Headquart- I'm sorry, this is the Galactic Veilstone Building. <laughs> Cosmic Energy for the win! Wouldn't it be wonderful if we could harness that boundless energy? I think that uh, Galactus would kill us. We, Team Galactic, will take everything that can be taken! We will eliminate everything that is not needed! That is Team Galactic's policy! Team Galactic conducts R&D around the clock here. We focus on the development of new energy resources. You're too young for us. You can join us when you're older. But I'm not too young to kill you! Throws a bomb. <laughs> Voltorb, go! I guess this is just the exit, then. Just in case that was actually a teleporter, I didn't want to accidentally yaws it. Well, let's see, they were saying it was going to Pastoria. Or however you say it. <laughs> That's the Pokemon League. Well, we're not going that way. Well, I guess we're heading to Pastoria. And on the way, maybe we can do some grinding. We didn't do any gambling. Um, Jubilee TV may have... Sure. <laughs> if you had to compare your, your mother to a Pokemon, what would it be? Coolness. Let's see. Hmm. I don't know. I swear any evil team would be fucked if my Galar team just Dynamaxes their Pokemon, then proceeds to throw it towards the evil team's lair. <laughs> hmm. Lucario. She is cool. <laughs> Dynamax would be dangerous for IRL use. It would, wouldn't it? Are you going to take 214? You're serious, aren't you? It's too badly chewed up and there's nothing to see there. Well, I guess there is that ruin maniac guy you could check out. That guy's been digging this way, his way through the bedrock all by himself. But I guess before we go go anywhere, we're going to head back and maybe get some... Bubba ba 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 Some Poketch technology. But really, Pokemon in general would be dangerous for the real world. And then I guess we'll head back for, to Veilstone, give Shine a massage so he'll like me more. Hi, hi, I'm the president of the Pokech Company. Hi, hi, your patience is rewarded. I've developed another new Pokech app! What's the marking app? The marking app allows the placement of markers. No shit. Having a map constantly displayed is convenient, no? You can also mark things so it's that much more useful. Maybe. Hmm. But I only have limited markers. I guess I shall place. We are gonna get you eventually. Ah, huh. interesting. I didn't even know I had that. It 
not like I actually use the Pokech much. The universe asked me, if you turned the corner and ran to somebody, what kind of p uh, person would it be? I answered, everyone. You ran into the entire country of Sinnoh. Come, my Staravia. We will kill God. Ba -ba -bum -bum -bum. And let's see, I do believe this is... Or is this the clown house? Well, depending on your definition, could still be the clown house. All right, Shine, you're gonna get a massage today so that you like me more. Here you go. Let's get started, okay, sweet. Just relax. This lady has some dojins made of her, isn't there? Extremely content. When I was beside your Pokemon, I found this. The Mystic Fire, what? Oh, it was a fashion case item. I was just like, what do you mean? <laughs> You're not gonna become a fire type Flareon Shine. You're going to become a badass Umbreon. Visiting uh, beautiful Lake Valor, right off 214. Now off we go to kill God! Are you an ace trainer or a psychic? There, behind you! I'm gonna throw you behind me. I forget. Will this work good? Figured I'd give it a try. My instinct is always, let's go for thing. Because of my unknown collection, the Ruin Maniac Tunnel is fully expanded and I can access the top part of the ruins. Interesting. Make it up, Roar, all you want. Now you die. You are a bell and I will murder you. You might be adorable, but you must now die. Cry harder. You're gonna send out a Curlia? Then I'll send out Amp to nom on your face. All right, Amp. Bite her ass. Nom. Haha, <laughs> critical hit. Bye bye. And a level up for Shine. And a Drifloon. Who should we send to fight the Drifloon? Because I think it's Flying Ghost, I think, is its typing? Um. I guess Lancelot. I mean, I guess I could have kept Amp out there, but... If Charm was a little less beat up, I would have sent Charm out. Then again, I guess I could have also sent... Well, no, I think you're still part ghost type, so... I don't think Shine would have been a good choice. Get bubble beamed. Kidnap these bubbles. A little bit of HP restored. My plan to spook you didn't go over all that well. I wonder if that's legal under, like, league rules for, like, random Pokemon battles. If you can just cheap shot your enemy. Look over there, a bomb! You throw a grenade. 
Anything's fair in love in Pokemon battles. You draw a sword. I will fight alongside my Pokemon. You become a maniac that's chasing children around with a sword. I don't know why, but like, the placement of the... I don't even know what that's called. Like, tunnel? Why do they have a tunnel? I'm gonna pick all these berries. All these berries are mine. They belong to me. If anybody else comes along to try and get these berries, I'll kill them. I'll give them some... I don't know. Some deadly nightshade. Take this AI boy. Alright, a guy down here to die. Alright, Shine. Let's see if we can get you some one-on-one -on -one time with me. When I toss this coin, you call it. Heads we battle, tails we battle. Now how will this play out, my friend? You're very bad at being Harvey Two-Face. You have one Pokemon. It's level 40 Goldeen. I don't know why I said it like that. Sand attack! I'm gonna throw three sand, three particles of sand in your eye. Why would you do that? That's illegal. Sand in your eyes. I'm gonna pollute your goldine with sand particles. Sand attack! And now, quick attack. My Eevee is faster than your stupid Goldeen. What are you gonna do, flail at me? You keep trying to use horn drill, it's not gonna help you. I threw sand in your eyes. Oh damn it, it actually hit this time, you fucker. Ah, it's a one hit KO, cause you're a bitch. Why does that have more than five uses? Let me get a revive out so they get some experience, you fucker. I'm sorry, after the first ten times that you tried to use Horn Drill, you shouldn't have been able to do anything. And now I'm gonna kick your stupid fish. Die. <laughs> so two things. I'm sorry, that should be illegal, you bastard. Again, why does it have more than five power points, that goddamn move? So two things. Uh, one, I just intentionally ran away from a shiny Jew, dude. You bastard. And you found Missy No. How could you do that? That's illegal in here. Like, I understand you're a gambler, but still, you deserve to be drowned in a lake. The coin came up tails and like it, my Pokemon is face down. And now you're probably a big enough bastard, you're gonna fuck that fish. Yeah, like, why does a one-hit KO move? But, like, yeah, it has low accuracy, but I then had it on to with three sand attacks, and it still hit twice in, <laughs> twice in my diddly battle. How dare you. At that point, the one-hit kill move should just never be able to hit ever. Three particles of sand in your eye, you can never move again, you're paralyzed. Especially because it was a fish on land. That gambling man must be sent to hell. No more gambling for him. Unless it's with his soul. Ah, oh, let's be honest, he doesn't have one. Rock smash! Magmarizer. What even? Just want to move him around a little bit, but what is a magmarizer? 
I assume it has to do with Magmar. It is loved by a certain Pokemon. It's just like going, ah, Pikachu loves this. I wonder what P Pokemon loves this item. Well, that's not good. But you know what is good? Insert the sponsor that doesn't exist here. I jump kick this this beast. This bastarding fuck. With the power of jump kick. Get jumped, get kicked. How dare you try to stomp on my bunny? Get jump, get kicked. Because the main thing is, I want to have Shine in actual battles. So that he, like, actually begins to love me. What's that? You say you have a Pokedex, an authentic one! Does that mean there are inauthentic Pokedexes floating around? Oh no, this missing note is permanent. It's supposed to disappear when you catch something. Oh no, you have doomed the world. You have doomed everything. All your progress will be eaten by that Misuno. It's just standing there menacingly, and this pen missile is going on far too much. Die. Well, that's just a bastarding thing to do. Now only my Hall of Fame. Well, at least it's just the Hall of Fame. And of course you live with one HP, you you motherfucker. Let me guess, crit. And nope. No crit. Hmm. Yanma, you say? That's a ghost type. Indigo, I choose you! Oh wait, no. <laughs> Silly me. My brain went Yawn Mask. And I was just like, oh, is this related to Yawn Mask? No, you idiot. Brain's dumb. I find Rhyhorn's Pokedex data hilarious. It says that if a Rhyhorn sees something in its territory, it'll chase it and then forget why it was chasing. Yeah, that seems to track for some of these Pokemon. How dare you detect. Now you must die. Maybe I should have done fly. For some reason, my brain was just like, Oh yeah, Yawn Mask exists. And I compl I always forget that Yanma is a thing. Tropius, huh? Flying grass, I think? Oh wait, that means that this is gonna cancel out. You've always- you've always been a weird Pokemon. Or maybe you're just pure flying type. You're weird. And a critical hit that <laughs> probably wouldn't have affected anything anyway. At least it had a little bit of extra health. Oh, you want to learn bite? We'll give you a bite. Let's see. Well, as always, quick attack is 40 power, 100 accuracy. Tackle is 35 power, 95. Why is tackle less accuracy than quick attack? I will never understand. Gonna send out Carnivine. No, it is grass flying. Here. Carnivine. Plant. Yeah, we'll send out Lancelot. Because we can. Leaves from the Carnivine. 
falling so slow. Hmm. I guess nobody really needs too much HP. Peck. I'm not afraid of you. See, he's a silly little man. Peck him again. And I heal off your pain. Aha, 69. Quit trying to drug my boy. And then he heals past the 69. Whip by only one. And a Tangla, huh? I shall attempt Shrine again, because he should get some more fighting experience. Sand attack. Throw sand in its beady little eyes. As always, three sand attacks and then we punch. And sand attack. Well, maybe we'll do four, because he's ugly. We need to spice up this evil spaghetti. More sand attack, because it actually landed a hit. That's illegal. Once again, it's beginning to feel like sand attack only ever affects me. I get hit with one, po like one sand attack. I just die. Enemy gets hit with sand attack, it can hit anything. It feels very rude, game, that you can do that. Poison should only do 1 HP of damage. That's just it. 1 point of damage. Like the actual poisons of the world. Kick this spaghetti. Kick this spaghetti. And of course, it's when the poison powder gets through the frickin' sand attacks. Hey, Curlia, you can kill this guy. Come on out, Indigo. Send him to hell. I'm shuddering with anticipation to watch you die! And die you will. Be gone. Your Pokedex fills me with much envy, envy, envy. You being alive fills me with anger. This is going to be like the one time that my Pokemon actually faints the poison, isn't it? Nope, survive the poisoning. That happens every single time. But I just know the moment that I start believing that Pokemon can't fate to poison outside of battle, one of my Pokemon will. The moment that I take my eyes off it is the moment it's gonna happen. That's just the law of the land. The moment you stop expecting it. It happens. Because it only happens when you least expect. Da -da 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 -da. We're gonna sneak up on this lady and punch her. Oh, a little kid like you is gonna teach me about Pokemon? I'm going to teach you how to die. For some reason, my brain went to a... Metal Gear <laughs> Rising Revengeance comic. He's like, I'll use this. A bread knife? 
a tool of justice. Well, that's a very poor choice of name for a kitchen utensil, isn't it? It amuses me. Why do you have bug bite? You are plant. Die for your heathens. You, why do you protect what is about to die? You fuck. Die. Plus, I feel like quick attack should get around protect because I'm just so fast. Are uh, you gonna send in another Wormadon? Are they part bug plant? Uh -huh. Charm, kick this plant. So what is Shine gonna evolve into? Once I get his friendship levels happiness enough, he should evolve into an Umbreon any day now. I guess just quick attack this. Quick attack this plant. What is the power hidden in the leaves? Forget. You are a whore. Kick this bitch. I just wanted to. For the. I do find it funny though that the hidden power did basically the same amount of damage as the bug bite. Keep quick attacking. This is where you get a crit, isn't it? And I cry. Okay, good. You didn't get a crit. But will I get a crit? Why'd you do that? You're just wasting our time. You being a bitch, I'm going to light you on fire. Cause pollution rise into the air. But not your spirit. You're going to hell. Good job, Shine. I should probably take the experience share off and give it to somebody else. He's been power leveled. He is now a buff Eevee. He has impeccable pecs. Kill. How dare you try to confuse the bird. The bird is not confused. It wants you to die. Murder him. Murder him to death. Wow, is that right? No, it's not right. It's wrong. You being alive is a sin. I will go ahead and take that. And we will swap somebody in front. Because now I think uh, we're in a good place to start normal leveling our Pokemon. Well, luckily I have a grass move to annihilate you, but you're probably going to try and explode because you're a bitch. Magical leaf! The Grass Cloak Wormadon is Bug Grass. The Sand Cloak is a Bug Ground, and the Trash Cloak is <laughs> something else. Could be Bug Dark, Bug... Poison? <laughs> I don't understand the Wormadon. I've never, like, uh, caught any for myself. Except for, like, quests and stuff. I just realized that, like, by the end of this Poke Marathon, it'll be a good time to, like, Play Pokemon Legends Arceus again. I like Legends Arceus. Only downside is like there's no way to get the cool masks now that the hit, like mystery gift things are done. Cause I really like the Omen mask, like the Hisui masks. Bug Steel for the trash one. Interesting choice. How much trash is thrown away that is steel? Bing, ba bing, 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 bing. Fight me! Fight me! I'm here to kill you! Fight me! I sensed the presence of a trainer for a while. It was you! I initially wanted to say bug steel, but I wasn't confident in my knowledge. That always happens. 
You think you have it? You think you got an idea? If I'm correct, this won't do anything. But let's try it anyway. That actually does do something. But you're gonna do more damage. And a critical hit, you whore! For giggles, I am going to throw out... And eh, we're gonna throw out Amp rather than Charm. Because it requires a lot of setup for Charm to really be effective against Goost. Get blasted. I should have used the bite. <laughs> Good SpongeBob voice. Can you feel it now, Mr. Krabs? <laughs> That's the only, like... Only one that I really know as a line from Spongebob. I've never watched a full episode of Spongebob before, I don't think. Get blasted, ghost. Hmm, Kadabra. Charm! Wait, why am I sending out Charm? I don't know why, my brain is going blig. My brain is melting. Get quick attack, idiot. You try to confuse the bird. Instead, they kill you. A critical hit that maybe sealed that in two moves, but I don't know. Goodbye, magic missile. Hmm. We're gonna head back and heal because we can. I'll get off my bike so I actually have control. For the power of bicycle, we run over people. Back to the Pokemon Center. Well, they're just like, Jesus, you come back a lot. I'm like, yes, I want my Pokemon to murder efficiently. Bing bong bing. <laughs> we hope to see you again, they say. Because they want your Pokemon to be hurt so they can heal them up. They have a nursing fetish. It runs in their family. And now we continue on, because we can. Like, surely there's gotta be an item. <laughs> I wanna cast Magic Missile, we all do. Magic Missile! Magic Missile! Magic Leaf! which would ba basically make it into a magic throwing star. Although, if I remember correctly, technically magic missile is basically just magically thrown projectile. That's basically what it's meant to be. All right, there's just a lot of graveler in here, which I guess is good grinding for Indigo. Blast away! We're killing a lot of rocks! Get rocked, idiot. A car boss. Who needs to eat more carbs? Ah, uh, just a Geo dude, but they don't give much experience and they die easy. Now, now, Indigo, don't be too picky on your food. Goodbye, Geodude. Geodudette. Yep, magic missile is a magically created projectile. That I think was created all the way back in, like, the olden days, back before 
D and D was properly D and D. Would you like to die? For the sake of my collection, I can take on people I know I can't beat. That's what a collector does. You sound like a madman. Oh, it's you! You are collecting lovely little evolutions. I'm gonna have to kill you, though. Confusion! Well, that's not good at all. If it used an actual electricity attack, it'd probably do tons of damage. Because right now, I'm leading in damage. Now you're gonna get a crit and you're gonna kill Indigo, aren't you? Aren't you? Okay, good, you didn't. I'm just trying to hedge my bets on my luck. A lot of experience. Vaporeon, eh? I'm gonna throw an amp. Did you know? Ah, uh, Vaporeon. Time to get blasted. Then again, on the internet, that's probably what happens to Vaporeon every single day. You took, like, took that like a champ. <laughs> I just pur purchased an advent calendar. I always forget exactly what an advent calendar is. Just, it's never really been something I've thought about all that much. It's just, it's a thing that exists. It is February. Barely. We're getting to the point that it won't be in a little bit. Hmm. I'm gonna give Charm the attempt here. Alright, Charm, can you beat this Flareon? If I remember correctly, this is one of... <laughs> it should be, like, stats-wise, the worst evolution. Like, tactically speaking. I still think Flareon is cool. Oh, you're a bitch. Well, you know what? Foresight! Well, will that help? Will that help at all? <laughs> Might as well try! Maybe Foresight doesn't help me. But I'm still gonna hope it does. See, Shine, this is who you're not gonna become. The attack right was remarkable. You ought to be proud of it. You mean quick attack over and over and over again until you cry, mommy? Fight me. I probably should have changed my team. I travel all over the world in search of mysteries. But have you found Carmen San Diego? I purchased a Christmas specific thing in late February. Christmas truly will never die. Uh, Lancelot, I guess I choose you. Considering what Kranidos did to me. Okay, maybe you're not going to be as scary as the Kranidos. Die. And then... Heal. Inhale. Why do you only have this one shield on? Are you just really dedicated to having a fossil-only team? And you've only found one? And it didn't even give out that much experiments! Your execution will come. Alright. Oh, because there's multiple people. For some reason, I thought that was just like that one guy. Ba -ba -ba -da, ba -ba 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 -da. 
You wanna find a bunny? Aha, I found me a trainer. I challenge you to battle with a Pokemon I found. I'm gonna throw your Pokemon to hell. Damn it. Cause I think you're Psychic Steel. So I'm gonna have to swap out to somebody else. I don't think I, I don't even think I know what typing you are properly. I think you're just annoying is what you are. Hey Amp, you wanna try and kill this guy? Spark, I guess. Because at least it does normal damage. Why would you even try to imprison? It does nothing. <laughs> I avoid trainers and complete all living decks. You go after all trainers and don't care about the decks. <laughs> Basically. Like, if I actually sat down and, like, tried to do a, a proper decks, I probably could. But just like, uh, for me, I just want to get the Pokemon I want to go do the things I want to. And once again, doesn't really have all that much. Hmm, Kranidos. I forget. Would Charm be able to high kick him to death? But like, even if I did do the Pokedex, I would still try to go after all the Pokemon trainers. Oh, it has Mold Breaker! <laughs> what does Mold Breaker do? I don't know. For some reason, I thought, like, oh no, Mold Breaker, that's scary, but I don't know why. I guess we'll come down and fight you. <laughs> to find my favorite Pokemon, I'll go east, west, or any which way. Yeah, I guess that's a mood. And you only have one. Oh, hey, it's a Porygon! It's the Bandmon! It's the band one. Jump kick, I guess. Fear the power of kicks. Goodbye, Porygon. And then Charm leveled up. But they're rare Pokemon. <laughs> I will get Pikachu and return to that trainer. We will reenact the episode of Doom. Like, I seriously wonder why. Oh, hey, there's a cave. I completely missed that. You see, I'm dumb. <laughs> yeah, I honestly, I honestly wonder why they've yet to bring in Porygon to the anime. Like, the initial anime is over. It was done, the run. The, ver the very same anime that caused Porygon to not appear in any other anime is done and over with. Bring it back already. Like, are they seriously that afraid that if they brought Porygon back, people would be like, Oh my god, they're trying to trying to give... Oh, the cave is useless without every unknown. But still, might as well familiarize myself. Everyone calls me the Ruin Maniac. I don't care what they call me. I'll just keep chipping away at the rock little by little. Do you know why? I'm a Ruin Maniac who is fascinated by unknown. I know it's a little sudden, but how... About you and me have a race. You go and catch the unknown and I'll keep digging away. We'll have a race to see who can get things done faster. <laughs> we got dig. Probably like, never gonna use it, but... Yeah. Oh. We shall continue down. Should probably see who I should throw out in front to start leveling. And again, if I use 
charm more. Hopefully I'll be able to get her to level up and evolve into Lop Honey. I don't even know what level that Lop Honey evolves along with friendship value. On the way. A hound hour. Ooh. stain You're part dark type, so we can kick you. Mm. If you survive, I'll try and catch you. No, you died. But at the same time, maybe I'll wander about. I don't think I have a fire type, so. I guess it wouldn't be terrible to catch a hound hour. And then it's just a rye horn. For some reason, my brain just went, do you think in the Pokemon world, instead of saying horn dog, they say you rhine horn dog? I don't know why. Honestly, it would make more sense in the Pokemon world than it does our world. Kick the rock man. And thus, Mega Man will never be released out of Japan. The space-time continuum has fallen. <laughs> and another one. Let me guess, Houndour is a rare Pokemon here. We'll level up Charm once more in our search for a Houndour. Swap to somebody else. Does Reinhorn even have a tail? Or did it just twerk at me? Now that's not quite the distraction dance I'm used to. And what will be next? God. Man, if only there weren't so many rock types, this might be a good place to try and grind, like, happiness points with Shine. Oh, I like that animation for the scary face. But still, what do you mean you kept going and crashed? Oh, that's, that's a funny thing. That amuses me. <laughs> My living dex is incomplete without Missy No. Does it really count? I wonder if Nintendo would ever acknowledge Misuno. Or if they have in the past. Doubtful, but still. One more and we'll swap train to level up charm. And then I need to go back and buy things. More resources. Alright, Indigo, come in here and murder Rockman. Two. I think that's going to kill him. You fucker. How dare. Get to bubble beamed, bitch. How dare you magnitude my bird. Not bird. I don't know why my brain just bleg. My Curlia. You know, I just realized I don't even have to go back all the time. I can just, well, actually, teleport. <laughs> Missy No is my favorite fruit. Honestly, it would be kind of interesting if they did, like, a Pokemon movie with Missy No. Like, we already have the unknown, which are weird little munchkin monsters. What if they broke a Terran reality and, like, hell, maybe even make that the re revenge of Porygon. Porygon was seen so badly because of an event of Pikachu that it just twisted its data up on side and became the missing no. I've never had dragon fruit. Because my brain is telling me that is a real fruit. 
Could be my brain's lying to me. Can't really trust brain all that much, can we? I do like that we can, like, uh, ride our bike, but not through, like, the super tall grass. Ah, there you are. The Hound Hour. All right, quick attack. We'll try and capture you. I forgot to buy supplies. And then... Game you are, fucking whore. The one time I don't want a critical hit, you're like, Hey, I have a critical hit! Dragon fruit is large pink kiwi that looks like fire. Interesting. Mine, teleport me back. We'll buy some stuff. We go. We gotta buy things. I require the power of God. And porn. Oh, yeah, I guess we should buy a few revives. We used a lot of them. But hey, we still beat the boss. And that's all that matters. Hmm, if Arceus created the world, doesn't that also mean that Arceus created Pokephilia? Especially considering that humans came from Pokemon. Or at the very least, they like married Pokemon, ate at the same table, yabba da yabba da. With many, many hints and wink wink nudge nudges that they still fuck. And now we can... <laughs> Alright, just interrupt the road with this patch of grass. For some reason. Hello, Staravia. Would you like to die? I'm going to break your wing with my mind. Get blasted. If you get too bad, I'm just going to throw out charm and blast you. With the power of foresight. You should be... Come on. Yeah, you go first and you hit... If I really want to, I could just swap train. Hmm. We'll let some others do that first before we result to that. Then again, we could always just put the EXP share on you if I really wanted to. Motherfucker. Then again, I think this is actually a good matchup. So far, water type. Time for you to die, beaver man. You hear the sound of water running, and now you're going to die. It's super effective, and yet it still lived, which should be illegal. Now my brain went back to the topic of Pokemon racism. What is Shine's favorite flavor? I do not know. An Ultra Ball, just out here somewhere. That means that a powerful trainer died. And I didn't heal. Hey, Giraffe Rig! Ha! Huh. Neat. Haha, <laughs> you're gonna baton pass? You can't baton pass. You fool. I guess I'll try to capture you, I guess. Oh no, that means we can't run away now. Hey now, you can't run away now. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get a gun. Bang. 
Um, Ultra Ball, I guess. Oh dear, here we go again. <laughs> yeah, because I was mostly just on the thought process of, like, in a world of Pokemon. Like, especially Mystery Dungeon. I'll continue after this. The head on its tail contains a small brain that can instinctively fight even while facing backward. I was going to call you Harvey, but you're a girl. Well, <laughs> continuing on that kind of thing, I guess we'll call you Harley. <laughs> but back to my thought. It's basically like in a world of, like, uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon type. Wouldn't, uh, like, a water-type Pokemon be slightly justified in being afraid of, like, an electric-type they're like, an electric type killed my grandpa, okay? What stat can you sacrifice on Shine? I do not know. I am not a smart person. You'll think that I have the intelligence to know? Oh, camera people? What are the camera people doing at the Lake Vala? Another giraffe rig. Then again, these guys might not be bad, like, grinding. <laughs> you use agility in the, on this day of bitchness. Well, it doesn't really matter what Shine has now, but so much as what Shine's gonna be doing later. Because that's kind of the point of Eevee. But right now, he should have Quick Attack, Growl, Sand Attack, and Bite. Those are the moves that he has, I believe. Get paralyzed, you giraffe rig. For some reason, your name kind of sounds like a slur. It's like when you say it, it has that kind of intensity. All right, what are you doing? The Pokemon of the lake won't come out if it senses people. We're lying in ambush for it. I'm gonna get my, my Pokemon Gunmon to kill you. Plus, I intend to level up Shine to be a... Uh, well, evolve Shine into an Umbreon. Like, God, can you imagine if my favorite evolution that was available right now was... <laughs> was like, uh, Espeon? It would suck to be me. I only stream at night. Get paralyzed, you Staravia. No one's gonna come and save you. Get blasted. But now we'll continue on. Eh, we'll go ahead and level up Amp since we're here. Do, do, do. Another giraffe rig. You are going to die. No one will find you. Now my brain just went, if you cut a giraffe rig in half and, like, spread the parts around in a place where people don't know what giraffe rig is, they would think it was two different animals. I don't know why I thought that. It just came to me. Get blasted. For the power of electricity, you will die. And we'll level up for amp. Swagger. I don't think I care for swagger, but let's let's give it an argument. User enrages the foe into confusion, all sharply raises the foe's attack. That is confuse Ray, but worse. No. Never. 
uh-uh. Like, why? If you wanted a Pokemon that could confuse people, why would you ever do anything like Swagger? Hello, bird boy. Bird girl. You're probably gonna, like, two-shot my indigo. I completely forgot. Indigo is a fool. Really good in double battles if ally has a berry. Oh, that makes sense. It's a strategy move, so not for me. You whore. Why would you do this to me? Then again, I guess it's, like, not that bad considering that... Well, we were, like, dealing with a bunch of, uh... Giraffe rigs there, so it wouldn't really be a good place... For... Indigo? Hello, lady. What am I to do? I've gone and dropped my sweet key somewhere again. Pokemon people won't be happy with me. I'm sure I had it left when I left the reception earlier. If only I had a Pokemon Poketchup dowsing, mach uh, dowsing machine, it would be so easy to find. Is that what it's actually called? The dowsing machine instead of, like, the finder thing? So we just need to find reception. Stop, stop, yes you! Sunny Shore City, which is down this way road, has a major blackout. Crews are working restoring power, but the road's closed now. What if I don't believe you? Just want to make sure, because... Maybe it's in the reception? Nope, it's the restaurant. So everyone else just... Has their place someone? Hi, I'm the game director. Oh, you're working and filling the Pokedex. I hope you'll come show me your Pokedex when it's filled up. Probably not. Because that takes a lot of work. And probably trading. I'd rather be in a pool than at the sea. The salty tang of the sea tastes like my tears after a hard day at work. I don't think that's a good thing. Hmm, the certificate. Hello, clown. We are a traveling troupe of street performers. In a place of a formal introduction, please take this. What is this move? Social anxiety. Trick Room is a doozy of a weird time twister move. Use it for a while after when the slowest Pokemon moves first. Before the fast Pokemon faster can move, the slowest gets to attack. How can you use the move? It's up to you, trainer. Me, I'm just a simple guy. I let my guitar do all my talking. All I need is music and Pokemon. I can shine wherever I go if I have those things in my life. I hear there are guys like me who can go around Pokemon and sinners. Let me gaze into your eyes. I will read your fortuna. A brief occasion of joy is imminent. But remember this, the good and the bad are the opposite sides of a coin. We still haven't gotten Rock Climb. Is that right? You're a traveler? Yes, it's good to see other places. Have you heard of the World Islands and the Johto Reach and the Silver Colored Pokemon? I must see that during my lifetime. So if we bring you Lugia, will you, what, shit your pants? Hmm, maybe it's just out front. She said she had it at the reception. Aha. Uh -huh. Now I can live in her suite. I can kick her out. What am I to do? I've gone and dropped my sweet key. Oh, that's my sweet key. You found it for me. Oh, that's sweet of you. Thank you. Thanks for helping me out. Here's something for your trouble. The white flute. I didn't even see where it got put. A mostly white flute made from blown glass. Its melody like uh, makes wild Pokemon more likely to appear. Interesting. So that's the grind flute.
for when you want your Pokemon to get twerking. Ah, penis pills. Just wandering around. Talk to you. This hotel is so romantic. I hope a night on a Pokemon will sweep me away for a honeymoon. Instead, you just get a Corviknight. Ah, hello. You wish to stay a night? Ah, but you have no reservations. I'm afraid we're totally booked. You may rest a while if you wish. Well, that's nice. <laughs> White flute is really good for you. When you're trying to do a Pokedex, <laughs> a living Pokedex at that, running into as many Pokemon as possible probably helps. And then a yellow shard. And then a gunpla. Hehe, <laughs> I can battle too. You're not gonna battle soon after I break your legs. Oh, look at that Meryl. It's gonna fucking die. Magical leaf! How dare you survive? How dare you use rollout on me? Magical leap! I'm gonna get your Meryl high. I am angry, and this is gonna be a crit! Come on, I dare you. Okay, good. Lucy made me all hungry now. And what? Not the breakage of your legs? Hello, child. I'm here to kill you. Isn't this nice? I love my inflatable tube. On Route 213, there's a dude obsessed with feet. That's weird. On today's episode of... The author's barely disguised fetish. How dare you bomb my indigo? Die! Get blasted, Shalos! You will never see the light of heaven. Give me a ribbon for showing him my Pokemon's feet. Pokemon, man, sometimes. Ah, great, hidden power. That's gonna, like, nuke me, isn't it? Or it'll do nothing at all. Nothing at all! It's shurikened by leaves. Huzzah. Let's see. It's been a while. Nova! Murder time! <laughs> On today's episode of What the Fuck is That? That also happens a lot. Get wing attack, idiot. Not water pulse. That's illegal in five counties. But I guess since we managed to level up you once. We'll take the deli back. Wait a minute, what was that? Ah. There we go. I just didn't click far enough. Didn't click hard enough. Didn't murder God hard enough. Somehow Shine became a most leveled Pokemon, and I don't know how. 
Hello, would you like to die? This is a fancy hotel in a fancy place in a restaurant. The fancy restaurant's filled with fancy people who think of themselves as being too fancy to battle alone. Oh, so that's a, a double dual hellscape, I guess. It is nice of him to let us, like, sleep in the, in the lounge to heal up our Pokemon. Oh, Dr. Footsteps house. Uh. What? No, just now. Is it just about to reel it in? Well, you're not going to reel in jack shit while I'm here, Barry. I'm going to kill you. Your name is Barry now, not Kenneth. Kenneth is a stupid name anyway. My name for you is better. You understand, little man? Wing attack. Level. Send another Remoraid. And then send in another Remoraid. Squeak squawk. And then a level up for Nova. <gasps> Aerial Ace. Aerial Ace, man. Aerial Ace. I don't want to get rid of Quick Attack, though. Let's see. 60. Confounds the foe of speed and slashes. Lands without fail. Hmm. Obviously, we're not going to get rid of you. Ah, actually, pretty good damage. If you can spare. And since you're out of the way of attacks with fly, it actually kind of justifies the use a little bit. Hmm. 60 damage and lands without fail. I think I might just replace wing attack. Because 60... Because they're both 60, we just lose out on some power points. But it allows me to keep double team and quick attack if I want to use Nova in a situation where a uh, flying move isn't good. So yeah, I think I'll just get rid of wing attack. Because it's basically the same. Go to Safari Zone before Gym Leader. When you defeat Gym Leader, Team Galactic launches the first nuke. <laughs> Is there even anything interesting in the Safari Zone for me to get? Well, I guess I can wander around there. Maybe catch Pokemon there. I don't know if there'd be anything there. I've, I've never been a fan of the Safari Zone. Also, this guy's just gonna fucking die because it's flying water. Hello, you have, uh, you've come to die? Goodbye. How dare you go first? That's illegal. Burn. And a crit. That that Gyarados is dead. That Gyarados is just dead, gone. You need to have more respect for a grown-up. I will never respect you. You are dead to me. I guess we'll check out the feet, man. While we're here, we're passing by. <laughs> I'm playing Soul Silver right now. It's good. Yay! Pokemon are quite easy for me to read. I need only see their footprints and their innermost thoughts are revealed to me. Oh, you're skeptical of my claim? Then let your Stravia walk in front of me right here. From its footprints, I will determine how it feels about you. If I said there could be friendship between Pokemon and people, will Stravia friends understand? But if you see Neon and Nova, you will understand. Because Neon and Nova are friends. And that is what your Stravia thinks of you. I must say, your Stravia and you share a very close bond that is for you. The footprint ribbon. Congratulations, you are forever bonded as a footprint. Uh, let's see, what does my <laughs> Bonary think of me? This adventure of Neon is lots of fun. Charm gets to go places where I can't go by myself. I get to battle Pokemon I've never ever seen before. I'm gonna get stronger and stronger for Neon. And that is what your Bonary thinks of you. Let's see. A 
let's fight you to death. Let me demonstrate my technique. It's how this grown-up battles. Then again, I should probably go do the double battle hell. That's some experience that we're missing out on. You're just a normal type, right? I'm gonna kick your ass. Or I guess kick your pussy in this case. Get kicked. Idiot. Oh my gosh, you attacked that savagely? It's what you get. Now I guess we'll... Well, I guess we'll grab this Pokeball item first. Which will probably mean fighting this guy. Well, Aerial Ace, we just learned that. Fine, fight me. Oh, never mind. Why don't you tell me, but how am I supposed to climb up? If only I could bike up. Well, I guess we'll go to the fancy restaurant and do a bunch of fighting. Hmm. Trying to level up charm. Evermore. Then we should probably have Shine do some battling as well to try and get him to like me. Let us go to the double battle hell. I forget, did we check out these two buildings? Yeah, that's the guy that wants to see Lugia. He wants to see giant Lugia mama milkers. At our restaurant, you can enjoy more than just exquisite dining. You may also partake in battles. Bon appetit! We'll have a little star off of this team, I guess. And this beverage's coloration borders on the positively toxic. However, my analysis indicates that it is composed of natural ingredients. What is it? You are? Oh, yes, a trainer. I will kill you. Alright, I guess high jump kick the A-Palm, and then aerial lace the Kadabra. We are going to have to kill that Kadabra quickly. Never mind, we got a crit and he's dead. Now high jump kick that monkey. Get out of here. Ah, oh, poor little Meryl. You're going to die. <laughs> I jump kick. You bitch. Quick attack! Quick attack! Double quick attack. Murder him now. <laughs> Once again, critical hit that was not needed at all. Aw, oh, how cute. A Swablu. Quick attack. And quick attack. Ba -ba -da, ba -ba -da, ba -ba -da. Ah, you fool, you try to sing in the middle of combat, we will murder you. I failed to foresee this outcome. You know I had confidence before heading into this. You are undeserving of confidence. The results of battles are insignificant. Let's drink up. Oh, sure. Turn away from your shame. Your shamu. Fufu, Eugene, you act so different from the way you do at this 
uh, the shop. You're surprisingly shy. I work at the Pokemon Good Shop because I love Pokemon. The job lets me be with Pokemon all day long. It naturally made me want a, a pretty decent at battling. Want to try me? Being behind a counter all day does not for a good trainer make. I want to steal your Feebas. I want to steal it for me. Spark the Feebas. Quick attack the Rosalia. Get rid of the fish! It's ugly because it is not mine. Now, if it were my, my Feebas, it would be the most beautiful Feebas in the world. But it's not, so therefore it's ugly. I don't care if I lose, I'm still a happy guy. Are you? Are you really happy? Or are you just ugly? I don't worry much about winning or losing. I keep my Pokemon with me because I love them. If you say so, but I don't believe you. What if I think you are a liar? And I think that you're actually here to kill God? What would you say then? Because killing God is my job. The weather of a meal isn't determined merely by its flavor. Presentation, that is, color and placement is vital. In other words, a fine meal can be linked to the finest work of art. And in Pokemon battles, I also hope to see beauty. You do agree with me, yes? Now my brain went to battle prostitution. And I don't know why. But hello, Ishmael, we're gonna kill you. Or are you gonna kill us? Da, ba, ba, ba. Kill the cricket. Kill the Psyduck. Say goodbye. Shit, it lived. Magical Leaf the Duck. They both lived, son of a bitch. And of course it caused confusion. Motherfucker. Magical leap to Psyduck again because it's ugly. And it made you confused. It's passed on its condition. Break through the confusion. Yeah. Leap that motherfucker to death. Face the power of leaves. Does this mean I'm only talented as an artist? I mean, you, you've only had one Pokemon. The meals prepared here are not merely tasty, they are also healthy. Diners need not worry. Diners need not worry about ruining the figures eating here. Throw Charm in and see how this battle does. I have to hand it to my father. These old doves are delicious. Are you maybe asking me for a battle? Well, certainly I never back down from a challenge. Oh, no, I'm completely wrong voice for the guy. Completely, <laughs> completely wrong voice for the guy. But uh, we need to kill that lick tongue because he's a beach. Slow him down, kick him in the tongue. And remember, while you're fighting in a diner, remember to stay hydrated. Damn it, he lived. That's against the law, living. And that is gonna hurt my boy. Not the Bicon. And it didn't even really do all that much. You kill him. While well, we kill the Cleffa. You slut.
you dare use healing items? That's my job as the protagonist, not yours. Not yours at all. Again, that Cleffa is just, like, not doing much. Oh, well, kill the Cleffa. Bye-bye, Lickitung. And your stubby knees. And a level up for Lancelot. Ba 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 da ba ba Now your girlfriend is all alone fighting me! That Cleffa is an, an insult to life itself for not giving much experience. Kick the Cleffa. Bubble beam the Cleffa. I don't know what that does. You're still gonna die. Goodbye, Satan. You are now dead. I never thought I'd lose at Papa's restaurant. Oh, how could I lose at your Papa's restaurant? Oh, never mind. They were <laughs> brother and sister. My bad. Fine, now we can go back and join our meal without disruption. You're the one that said that you were going to take any fighters you don't back down from a challenge and then got your ass whooped. Stupid kid. Heal up my Pokemon. Now, let's see, who should be put in first? Probably Nova. <laughs> They're an Alabama couple. Nah, Sinnoh probably doesn't have that. Not sure where would have that in the Pokemon world, but somewhere. Ah, oh, it's just a tree for honey. I wonder what wild Pokemon exist here. A Wingle! For some reason it feels late in the game for a Wingle. I stare at you. Quick attack! Yeah. Now my brain went, wouldn't it be interesting if you could just catch wild Pokemon that new HM moves? Why does Water Pulse cause confusion? I don't understand. And I'll level up for Nova. Interesting music that's playing here on this route. Ooh, berries. We'll have to pick those up. Hello, Shellos. I'm going to stab you with a wrench. Do you know what a wrench is, little Shellos? You probably do not because you are a dumb squid thing. Die. Good. Fighting, more leveling, more killing. You are about to die to the power of leaves. Wait a minute. Because you are like part flying, part water, this probably will do like normal. Why do you get a critical hit, you bastard? Nobody loves you, you whore. Confusion! Get 
give me the berries. The berries are mine. The berries, they belong to me. Even though I don't understand, like... I don't think I've run into, like, half these berries before. Like, imagine if they put all of these berries into the Mystery Dungeon series. Go back here. <laughs> I like that this is just like a bootleg Pokemon Center. I will try to get a bit more fighting with you in. See if we can beat up a bunch of Pokemon. So that when you level up, you get good stats or something. Ball, ball, ball. Get blasted by the power of magical leaves. And it didn't even do all that much shit. And you have... Why are all of you strong against poor Indigo? Please die. Be gone, Satan. You crinkly motherfucker. <laughs> Gotta go for a bit. No problem at all. Depending on how long it is, we may or may not be here. Because I think we're getting near Posteria Town, but we might also have to do grinding, which I might do partly off stream. I don't know. Footprints are left in the sand when you walk on the beach. Pokemon seem to enjoy leaving footprints as much as people. Listen, do you know about the Battle Frontier? Yes, I guess you're someone who's in the know. I hear it's a fun place of facilities for battling through under different sets of rules. I didn't like Emeralds, Battle Frontier. It was a bad place. I'm visiting here to see the Great Marsh. I'm staying at the Lakeside Hotel. Good, the package hasn't arrived from the Veilstone Warehouse yet. I have to wait here until then? I'm gonna be batty waiting. Oh man, I wish I could do something that involved lots of explosives. Yep, this is gonna be a smashing job for Team Galactic. <laughs> Observe. Ah, the Great Marsh. Well, I guess we can give that a look look while we're here. Come on, let's jump on our Pokemon. Let's do a battle, kiddo! Sure. Interesting. This random guy here wants to fight. One Pokemon. That is a Krikatoon and will die immediately. Is it even legal to fight in a Pokemon Center? Aerial Ice! Get blasted, idiot. You beat me, but I feel totally am to jam harder! The Great Marsh is vast. How vast is it, you ask? Take a look at the observatory and you can see for yourself. Heal up our Pokemon before the bombs drop. Ba, 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 ba. To the observatory. Are you playing a safari game? How would you like me to try out my, uh, try my game out at the same time? The rule, yep, there's only one. It's real simple. All you have to do is capture five or more Pokemon in one safari game. If you can do that, I'll give you the Pokemon for matchup checker. Interesting. I'll start off 30 safari balls. That's the only bo kind of ball you're allowed to use. The game is over when you run out of safari balls or when you've walked 500 steps. Please do enjoy the untamed nature of the Great Marsh. Interesting. 
Tell me I'm not imagining this. The Great Marsh's Pokemon seem to be different from the ones yesterday. Oh, that's a mean mechanic. There are shuttle trains in the marsh called Quick Trams. You should take those if you're going deeper into the marsh. Here's a pair of binoculars to look out over the Great Marsh. You can see all kinds of Pokemon can be caught and where they are. When you're walking in the bog, you sometimes sink right in. There's something pretty cool about it, though. If you turn while you're stuck, sometimes Pokemon may pop out. <laughs> Lots of Yanma. Lots of Yanma. Lots of Yanma. And a Quagmire. Or Quagsire. My brain's bled. And Whooper. And Tangla. And Yanma. Doesn't seem like too many Pokemon that I care for, but there do seem to be items in there. For $500, we can murder a lot of Pokemon. Gotta be careful on our, like, walking steps. <laughs> Just a great ball. Team Galactus is gonna go full on, pull out an, pull an Oppenheimer. Maybe. Considering they're like, ooh, where's the explosives? I don't understand the safari mechanics at all. When walking on land, it covers its body with a poisonous film that keeps its skin from dehydrating. Hmm. What shall we call you, little woo? My brain says just to call you woo, so you are woo. I should have called you Uwu. I hate this mechanic of falling into the marsh. <laughs> Ah, so rock makes it easier to catch, higher chance to run, bait is opposite, okay. Get mud, idiot. And then safari ball. Damn it. catch you anywhere. I don't care about you. I just want to walk game. Yeah, I, I really don't like this mechanic. Because you have to get out, fall back in, wiggle around, get into a fight, keep on walking. It's very positive ways. How do we even run? We're stuck. Game, just let me fucking walk. I want to move up. I want to move up, but then game is like, oh, no, you don't get to. And because, like, sometimes the just tapping doesn't register as a tap, so it's like, meh. So you walk now. I'll throw a safari ball. If we catch you, we catch you. We got you.
It can hover in one spot by flapping its wings at high speed. It fits about. It flits about the, uh, to guard its territory. I don't care about giving you a name. I am annoyed. I already caught one of you. Be gone. Frustrating mechanic. Just let me walk. I'm gonna start speeding up. Just let me get out of here. Yeah, just like things that obstruct my movement are just very annoying. I dislike it lots, especially because it happens so much. Like, have it happen once every ten steps, not every single one. I would like to go places, game. Or like, have it be like noticeable of where you'd fall or something. At least it seems like in, if you get into an encounter, it seems to, like, activate normally. Great googly moog. Again, it's every single fucking step. It's annoying. Hi, Tropius. Get in the ball, I guess. Get in the ball. Delicious fruits grew out from around its neck because it always ate the same kind of fruit. I don't think that's how that works. What kind of name shall we... Hmm. Give, what kind of name should we give you, Tropius? Brain says DK, so you get DK. You are DK now. I'm just here for items more than anything. I would like to be able to walk, please! The fact that it's every single step is so annoying. Okay, it's not every single one, but it feels like it's every single one. Throwing food at Pokemon makes them more likely to bolt. But when they're eating, it makes them easier to catch. Mm. If you throw them at them, they get harder to catch, but they also get less likely to bolt out of anger. Then we shall throw bait. And then throw ball. And then throw ball. And then throw ball. <laughs> that one just did not want to <laughs> do it. <laughs> oh, it's different. I'm dumb. Oh, it's fine. It's entirely possible that they changed it between games like Safari Zone. It did that. Marsh Diddly D. It does this. Who knows? Or it could just got swapped around in your brain. Brains do that too. It has an easygoing nature. It doesn't care if it bumps its head on uh, boats and boulders while swimming. I have no name for you. I loathe this. We already caught a Tropius. Back again. I mean, I guess we can spare a single ball. Waste my balls, why don't you? I wish I could just spam the down button and be able to walk forward. Hi, right, Tangela. Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Get in the ball. The blue vines surrounding its body are covered in growth of fine hair. It is known to be ticklish. 
We shall call you Spaghetti. The most original name for a tangle that ever did exist. Spaghetti. At least I think in this area. Why is it every single step? Okay, could be that's like the darker areas, but it's hard to tell with the grass. The grass makes it hard to tell where a, like a proper walking place and not walking places are. Unless you can just fall into any of them. I don't know. We are checking out the Great Marsh and trying to parse the falling into the marsh mechanics. I think I'm beginning to understand and still be slightly annoyed by him, but I am beginning to understand. Apparently we're in the Great Marsh Area 3. I still don't like the fall down mechanic since it happens every single time you take a step. I have now learned that there are places elsewhere. Sure, get in there. A river dammed by Bibril will never overflow its banks, which is appreciated by people nearby. I have no name for you. I didn't even... I was so annoyed by it. Because all I want to know is if there are items in there. Again, the fact that it's every single step. <laughs> I get it. You want to be different from the other safari zones. I understand. You are just making me dislike you and miss the other safari zones. That is all that you are doing. Oh, a knocked owl. I guess I'll try and catch a knocked owl. Probably won't be able to catch you because you're going to run away, but we'll throw some balls at you. I throw again. I'll throw again. And then it flees. And no items. Sadness. Seriously, how is this safe? This is not OSHA compliant. A hoot hoot. I guess throw bait. And then throw ball. <laughs> you found a shiny whooper. Is it any really surprise for you? It marks time precisely. Some countries consider it to be wise friend versed in the world's ways. What shall we call you? Hmm. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think of like an owl character that I know. Uh, they're all fleeing from my mind. Hmm. Instead, my brain says we shall call you Wednesday. Even though we did not catch you on a Wednesday. I guess. 
do wish that there was like a step count to let you know. Oh, area five is this way. Why would this not be area one? I think this place is terrible with naming conventions. Beep, beep. I just have to super speed up everything because it's just such... This is a mechanic. I sure do like having my steps wasted. And I keep forgetting that, like, getting into an encounter makes it so that you no longer are stuck. Which I don't know. Throws off my brain for some reason? It is kind of an interesting mechanic to have, but... Again, for some reason just throws my brain right out of the window. Oh, I think we're already here from the other side. Yeah, just interesting, but I do think that this is inferior to the other Safari Zones, because getting stuck is not an interesting mechanic. It just isn't. Also, again, uh, Area 5 being the closest area, and Area 1 being the furthest area, throws my brain off. At the very least, 500 steps goes a long way. I am disappointed that all these items are our Pokeballs. But hey, items are items. Things to look for while you face off Safarimon. I wish that it was just one turnaround and not just a full-on biggity bug. I caught lots of Pokemon. So how many Pokemon did you catch in your Safari game? At least five? If you've done that, alright, isn't that something? Well, here you are. Then the Poketchup matchmake che matchup checker. The matchup checker shows the affinity to p of Pokemon to each other. Now I know which of my Pokemon long to fuck. In the Great Marsh, quick trams and the rails are used for transportation. They prevent damage to the Great Marsh's ecosystem. They say, the though the name says quick, their movements are anything but. They're the quick trams that traverse the Great Marsh. I mean, faster than traversing the Quick Marsh. Quick, quick Marsh, the Great Marsh. But I do believe that that will do for now. We've been going for three hours. We beat a gym. We went through the Great Marsh, traveled a decent bit. I'll probably do a bit of grinding on my own. And then I guess, like, also f fill up the day between streams to give another mas massage to my Pokemon. And uh, then we'll probably take on Crasher Wake. And then just see about doing things. Yep, today was pretty good. Pretty good. Somehow I eked out a win against, I forget her name, the fighting type gym leader and her Lucario. I want Surf. Well, actually. I'm going to quickly check and see, like, uh, what items are in the Great Marsh. Because if there's, like, a good item in there, I might go back for it. Let's see. 
anything really worth it. Doesn't seem to be that many... Like, there's a bunch of good items in there. But... Does not seem to be... Bobbity Bop on me. So, yeah. Don't forget about the Cresselia meme. I know, I'm trying to remember, but it's mostly just brain being mean that's stopping me. Well, get around to it eventually. I am drawing a different thing that I just had, like, random energy to draw my rescue team that I'm going to color tonight. But I'll definitely try to get on drawing the Cresselia meme. See if I can have it up and ready to go for Pokemon Day at the very least. Oh, hey, that could be my Pokemon Day thing. Just swap out the you should disappear now part with you <laughs> You should release a, a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon game now. <laughs> that could work. So yeah, I'll definitely work on it. But yes, I had a lot of fun. Really hope that I can get Surf soon so that I can go and grab Lucario or Ru Riolu. I don't... The sad thing is I'm probably going to have to replace Charm with the Riolu before Charm even evolves into Lopunny. Sadness. Yeah. But such is the way of life. <laughs> or I could just decide to have just a completely unoptimized team and just do lots of grinding. That's also a possibility. Just have a full grinding, scre grinding stream. Hopefully that will align with the time that I can actually access the place where Feebas can be caught. So I can do, like, punch up a bunch of Pokemon while I'm searching for Feebas, then immediately go grind out Melodic. But at the same time, research what moves Feebas learns through level up versus Melodic. See if there's any hankiness there. Meh. But that's for when we can actually access that part of Mount Coronet. Yeah. Almost forgot. But, yes... Thank you very much for watching, everybody. If you want more stuff from me, then you can check out my link tree. And my link tree are links to everything I do, which is linktr.ee slash neonicywings, or it can be found as a direct link in the description and bios and link places of all the sites that I use, or at least it should. But through that link tree, you can find edited content YouTube videos, the recordings of all these streams I do, as well as the live streams on Twitch or YouTube. Other things that I do are writing, which I'm actually doing a decent amount of lately. I do believe I am on chapter four of my 11 chapter kind of uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon short story that I'm working on. Uh, as well as, let's see, the only, thing, uh, the only other thing I can think of, oh yeah, my art. If you want to see the Cresselia meme when it is made, as well as the other mainly Pokemon-centric art that I'm making right now, then you can follow me on various different art sites through my uh, link tree. And even not art sites, but I post there anyway. Twitter, DeviantArt, Newgrounds, B Blue Sky, lots of places. And then, if you're feeling super generous, my Patreon is also in my link tree, and it is basically just a little donation thing. It's nice, simple, and uh, maybe someday I will have benefits there for the people that are kind enough to donate to me. But aside from that, the next stream should be Monday at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. And... I guess I'll also throw this out there. Eventually, when the uh, Pokemon Day thing happens, I don't think I'll stream it, but I will upload it to the Neon Icy Games channel. I think it fits here good. The Neon Icy Games, me uh, I, uh, my brain's just melting there, YouTube channel. I'll record it, and hopefully you can see me freak out if a Mystery Dungeon game is announced. And that'll be a fun time. 
But yes, thank you very much for watching, everybody, and I hope to see you dudes next time. Remember, be you, be true, be happy, but most importantly, do be kind. And bye-bye.